everyone today I'm going to show you how to extend the MBR partition disk into a GPT partition without any data loss this is important when you are converting a, when you extend extending a drive more than a 2 terabyte because MBR partition can't cope with more than 2 terabytes size so if you are if you're using this production environment so this is very useful to extend without any data loss so I'm using this software called GPT disk so so um, I have already downloaded this software from SourceForge. Um, yeah, once you download extract file into a simple folder in C drive, so you will you will have this all the files. But uh, we only need we only need this GPT sixty four exe as we are in 64-bit edition windows so I'm going to get rid of these other files once you've done that you can you can open a, a administrator command prompt then on the list part yes put to check the what disk online so at the moment there's two disks disk one and disk two here it says 15 gig but um it doesn't say it's a gpd partition so we're gonna co convert into a gpd partition now so i'm gonna leave the admin command from separate also i'm gonna start a new admin command prompt to run this gpt GP GPT disk uh, exe file and locate this file in the C drive that we created. So once you get into the folder, you can run this command. To identify this size, make sure you do the exact same. There is no disk. This is this is where the disk um, disk number has to be. So we type zero to display the um, to display the partition of um, this zero. We need this one to convert into GPT because this zero is a uh, system drive where we install the operating system as you can see there's one partition of 10 gig that's what we would convert into GPT so make sure you choose the right disk so in this case we choose disk one that's we that's what we need to extend um, Once you find the right disk, we're gonna run this command. Gt disk, gt key disk 64.exe one. So it will ask you, are you sure you wanna continue? Uh, so yes. So in here, type R to record a transformation menu. So recovery the last recovery transformation command. So I'm gonna type F to make it to load MBR and make GPD from it. Warning this will destroy the current definition partitions. Proceed. Yes. I'm going to say yes. Record it. it will ask the recovery transformation command again. So request tension in me. So W2 by to disk and exit. It will ask confirmation okay, because it's going to override the partial table. So I'm going to press yes. This operation has completed successfully. 
Now let's see on disk management whether it's converted to there you go, it's, it's converted to GPT disk. Let's double check. GUID partition table. Right. So now you can extend the S drive into desired um, size as you wish. Because now it's it's not limited to two terabytes. So you can now in this case, in this case, I'm going to extend into five, fifteen gig. So extend one. Like this. Let's see. Let's check if we have the same data we had before. Yes, it does have the all the files we had. Uh, yeah. So there you are. Make sure you follow all the all the um, command as I type. Uh, make sure you choose the right text, otherwise you're gonna destroy your all the data. So be careful when you do that. If you have any question, please comment below. Thank you very much.